I'm back and I have my daughter here. This is Kayla and we are on our yearly summer vacation and having a couple margaritas. Um, we are in Gulf Shores, Alabama. We are on our last day of vacation. Have you had fun so far? Oh yeah, it's been a blast. Yeah. So we thought we would do sit down and do each other's makeup. Um, I have no idea what she's gonna do, <laughs> and she has no idea what I'm gonna do. You ready? Yeah, let's do this. All right, who goes first? And do my makeup first? All right. Okay. All right, so where should we start? You just take it away. All right, take it away. So I think I'm going to find some primer. Since I'm running out of this primer, I'm just going to wipe some on you. This is No Pore Bone Primer from Touch and Soul. Mm, that feels good. Maybe a tad more. I really like this primer. And I'm running out of it. <laughs> Zoom in. This is Bay Blue Luxe Liquid. This is a completely vegan, cruelty free. Um, Foundation, and it looks super dark in this bottle, but it actually comes out pretty light. So I'm gonna put a little bit just on each side. We don't have all of our makeup tools here. I'm gonna use a little sponge. I don't think I've ever done your makeup. Like eight years ago, <laughs> when you were like thirteen. Yeah. Having someone else do your makeup, it's so nice. <laughs> you like it? Yeah. your favorite part of vacation? Doing absolutely nothing. <laughs> and then the beach was great, of course. Okay. This is just the Ulta Beauty Finishing Powder. contour palette that you had forever this one mm -hmm. I love this the one. best ever do you still use it? no I ran out mine's almost gone yep <laughs> the highlighter is the best I love the contour color mm -hmm. did you use the contour color that was my probably use the least because I just I'm not very good at contouring I'm not either I just go like right under the cheekbone mm -hmm. for a line 
I don't do any kind of other like nose contouring or anything like that. Mm -hmm. And then kind of around the hairline like this. understand people who do the eye stuff first well a lot of times they do that first because um, of like fallout from eyeshadow yeah That's true. but the eyeshadows I have um, don't really do that mm -hmm. where's the blush here it is which blush would you like Ooh, the coral one the coral you think what do you think? This is Alamar. It's your nice. choice. I don't have any decision in this. All right. I kind of like the coral for the summer. As usual, I'm too heavy handed with the blush. <laughs> If you guys hear babies, it's our, my niece and nephew, her cousins. One's five mm -hmm. and one's like what, 20 months? Yeah. Yeah, something so. like that. Okay. I think we're ready for some, to do your eyebrows. using Anastasia um, Dip Brow. This is taupe colored. When I was 12, I basically plucked them all off, so it, it's pretty amazing that I still have any eyebrows. I remember when you did that. You want a little crazy plucking? I thought you were supposed to pluck from the top. <laughs> I had just a single line of eyebrow at the bottom. <laughs> oh, it was really bad. I'm trying to remember, I think you kind of like drew them on, didn't you? To try to overcompensate? No, that was that was before I feel like eyebrow makeup was a big thing. Yeah. I remember when you started wearing like eyebrow makeup, that was like five years ago, or six years ago. Yeah, I had bushy eyebrows and I made them crazy dark. It looked like I had caterpillars on my face. <laughs> it took me a while to uh, figure out my eyebrows. Yeah. I mean, eyebrows have gone through several phases, like, they go through like the natural phase and then the super bushy phase, mm -hmm. which was just like in the last couple of years. Yeah, and it was not a good idea. It shouldn't have become a trend. I remember like anytime you were just watching TV, like all the TV shows, like all the girls had like super dark bushy eyebrows. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, this doesn't look right. They're gonna be sad when they look back at pictures. Yeah, I am um, when I look back at my pictures. You know what I'm gonna do? What are you gonna do? I'm gonna line the bottom of your eyebrows since we got a little definition going on here. 
with a little bit of concealer. Pretty. All right, we need, what colors should we do? Some beachy Some colors? Some beachy colors. I'm either thinking this one or this one. Do you think you want like a warm colored, something like these two? Or you want to like, maybe have some kind of like bluish of gold? You surprise me. I feel like warm colors will look really pretty on you. How about that? Okay. Do you wear much eyeshadow? Sometimes I wear some if I'm feeling Get a little adventurous, I'll put on some pink eyeshadow. I have not practiced enough to do bold eyeshadow and have it look good. <laughs> yeah. I'm kind of the same way, I don't do very bold, but I have gotten more adventurous this year. Mm -hmm. It's all about putting the crease color in first. You'll probably think you're like heavily made up you're not used to seeing yourself with eyeshadow. I know. I don't even know what I look like. Got a bunch of makeup on. Going with the dark orange on your lids. And a light orange on all the rest. This is the this is also Alomar, which is the same as blush. I just blend this line right here. with like eyeliner mm -hmm. I kind of feel like you need a little bit of eyeliner do we do it myself yeah yeah, yeah. I'm pretty good at doing it you're myself. really good at doing eyeliner you do what kind of style what kind I like the one where you have that little wing okay yeah mm -hmm. She does this sweetest little baby wing. There's nothing more nerve-wracking than putting eyeliner on. I swear. I always 
not end up putting too much on. This, I want to be careful not to get any on the eyeshadow. Yeah. No. Anyways, mascara is so weird how it, um, it's like super liquidy when you first buy it. And when, um, then like after using it for like a week, it starts to like being like the perfect consistency. Yes. And then like after about a month of using it, it starts getting all like clumpy. And yeah, yeah, crusty and mm -hmm. dry. A little bit of highlighter. What do you think? Ooh, that color is so pretty. A little spritz. <laughs> you just breathed it out. I think I did a pretty good job. Yeah, it looks, looks great. You look beautiful. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Thanks for doing my makeup. My daughter is beautiful. <laughs> okay, so first I'm going to put on some primer. Get on my hands first because it's running low. And I'm super sunburned, so you might have to cover that up. Oh, your skin is so soft. I'm gonna say more. Some on your eyelids. Okay, and now I'm gonna do some foundation. Here. Is this a foundation brush? Mm, no, I usually use a sponge, but you can use your fingers or a sponge. I'll use my fingers. All right, so what you have to do this a weird top. You have to just basically squeeze one whole pump in your hand because it doesn't let you do half a pump. It's gonna start by making dots. I don't think there's anything coverage. You know the, like, um, Big time makeup artist, mm -hmm. but a lot of them use their fingers. Yeah. For our foundation. Yeah. And I always use my fingers, but then I started using a sponge like a year ago. But sometimes if I'm in a hurry, I use my fingers. I don't really like using foundation brushes. Do you? Well, you don't usually use foundation. I really only use pretty much a concealer for my under eye bags. So spread it on and I'm gonna use the brush to blend. Foundation has really good coverage. It does. So, yeah. That redness just like went away. So oh, it did. I really like this foundation. It's like a name, a brand I've never heard before, but it had a lot of ton of good reviews on it. Mm -hmm. I'll link it above. It is nice having someone do your makeup. I know. 
know, it feels like a like a half massage. <laughs> it does. <laughs> a little mini face massage. And then when it's done, you come out all pretty. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna get some shape tape. get super dark yeah like if I don't have a tan like they just look super dark compared to the rest of my face oh mine too they get like orange -ish. yeah makeup videos is like you would possibly try stuff that you would never think of trying yeah because it seems like we always gravitate to the same things mm hmm really cute pinks and neutral colors. What's it called? It's just the Wine Crime Venus palette. So I think I'm gonna start with this. That's just a light base. So we have a good, a good canvas. It looks it looks gray on here, but it comes out with a kind of a pink, pink tint. I think I'm just going to save the blush and the bronzer for the after deep eyeshadow. Right. 
So what I'm gonna do now, do you have a really, it's perfect. There's all of these, that's no, just you. So I'm gonna take this, this really deep plum color and I'm gonna line between your eye and the color. It makes your eyes look bigger. And then I'm gonna connect it to the top. Just do something more. Mother and daughter, makeup and mark. <laughs> I'm gonna actually blend this a little bit. do minimal eyeliner. Don't look for a mascara yourself? Yeah. Mascara. This is the one I've been using as the It Superhero for mascara. Ooh, 
feels good. Just gonna get some bronzer. What's the difference between contour and bronzer? Is there a difference? Is it contour I mean, I think, bronzer in a certain place? Yeah, I've always wondered what the difference is. It seems like when people put bronzers on, it's like they look more orangey. Mm -hmm. Whereas contour seems more neutral colored. Yeah. Does it seem like that? Yeah, definitely. so cute how your cousins little kids like when you say smile for the camera and they're like <laughs> <laughs> I've had that one for a very long time. That, that's a really nice color of red. What is this? Urban Decay? Urban Decay yep. Easy Green. I think we're about done. Oh, we are wow, done. That's awesome. Oh my gosh, come here. Wait, let's... I gotta do setting spray first, right? Oh, setting spray. spritz you. This is it, right? Mm hmm. Yeah. That's the Urban Decay All Nighter, which is really nice and refreshing. We did it! We did our makeup! Yay! We did a good job. I think you did awesome. We still are sipping on our margaritas. Cheers to a wonderful vacation. Cheers! And a makeup video. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Bye!